On guard. Ready, fast. <laughs> I'm about to get stabbed. All right, let's go. So we're here at the, um, what is this place called? Beverly Hills Fencers Club. Beverly Hills Fencers Club. And as you can see, there aren't any other fencers in here. Um, I didn't know I needed to bring my own. I'm gonna call Ethan and I'm gonna see if he's free. He is on the other side of town, so I have no idea. Tyler's out of town ride. I'd ask him. It's 9.53, I bet he's not awake. Didn't even fucking answer. God damn it. Okay, so I don't have any other friends. Okay, um, so Carla, I don't have anyone at the moment. Okay, that's no problem. Like, you wouldn't stab me. Oh, I would love to. You could stab me. I could stab you very easily. Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Um, I enjoy stabbing people. Do you, would you mind being the person that stabs me? Oh, no, not at all. Usually <laughs> no one wants me to play with them. But oh, okay. you're one of the first, so yeah. that's oh, awesome. Why not? You yeah. know, you're the one that's going to be teaching me, so I assume you know. I do. So I'm going to be teaching you the sport of epee fencing. Okay. And epee is the modern day rapier. And it's a three-sided blade made out of steel. And it has a button on the very end of it that depresses, sending electrical current through here into here. You have a wire. You're attached to a fencing strip. Oh. And when the button depresses on the soft, meaty parts of you, <laughs> a light will go off. Don't want to point the weapon at somebody who is not wearing a face protection mask. Like you just did. Yes, so what I'm gonna do is give you a basic lesson in fencing. So uh -huh. we'll start with the footwork and the positioning. Right. You might want to stretch out a little bit. Have you done? I'm any? so limber. You are so limber. Yeah, I did silk dancing last week, so I'm, I'm pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> so just a little bit of stretching uh, out. Maybe uh, this one's a good one where you cross your one foot over the other uh -huh, uh -huh. and just reach down and touch the floor. Uh, I got it. Yeah, so both hands should go down both like hands, this. Both hands, yeah. Well, I, I, I have a, uh, have a natural, like I, I've got a mental block of putting both hands down. It's, okay. It's not a physical inability. It's just like just, I, I don't want to, like I'm, I'm afraid of... These pants are very fragile. Fencing is a good thing to, to relieve stress. As you're stabbing somebody with a sword, it's very relaxed. I don't imagine I'm gonna be actually stabbing anybody today. I imagine I'm getting stabbed. No, 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 stressful. I'll give you a nice little lesson and you'll get to stab me. Oh, okay. Okay, so that'll be what fun. What about that dummy over there? Oh, that yes. dummy, yeah, that'll be as much fun to stab as me. Oh, okay. Because I can fight back. Oh. So that should be more fun for you, that don't you think? That doesn't sound fun. Oh, yeah, no. that'll be fun. You'll like I it. I like beating up on defenseless people. Okay, let me show you the first basic positions. Mm -hmm. I'll put the sword out of the way. The first basic position is the ready position in fencing. And that's, and you're right-handed, right? Right handed. So you take your right foot and you place it one way like this, and then you bring your back foot up. This is called the ready position. Your hands are down and you're preparing to salute to your opponent. How you salute is you extend your sword arm to your opponent, mm -hmm. you raise it up to the sky and then sweep down. And then you go into the on guard position. The mm -hmm. on guard position is pretty easy. All you do is take a step forward with just your front foot and place it down. And now bend both knees and center your weight. Okay, relax. Hold on, I'm gonna move you. Okay, relax. Ooh, relax, relax. There you go. Okay. Fencing is really a loose, limber sport. And then, <laughs> don't throw your head back. <laughs> it, it relax. Not that much. There you go. So basically, you're on the on guard position like this. I really have my wrist just flailing yeah, just, like this. Well, the reason is you don't want it in front of your body. You want to keep it back behind your shoulders slightly, but not too much so it's uncomfortable. And so this way, when you extend your arm, you'll be able to um, flatten out a little bit. It's a combat sport, and FA is first blood. So we're, you're not actually going to believe, but it used to be first blood. So from the top of your head to the soles of your feet is a valid target. Oh. So whoever hits first wins. Uh -huh. So you wouldn't want to put your full chest forward like this because you're a bigger target. So you're trying to keep your target area small so that when you reach and extend, your opponent doesn't have a larger target. Right. Makes okay. Sense. Makes sense? I get it. Okay, good. So your front toe is always facing straight and forward. And when you want to take a step forward, you just walk forward. Like this one, too. Just walk forward. Oh, that's a lunge, actually. Recover up. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you know how I saw you walking and you just normally 
walk? Yeah, I do know how to walk. Yeah, yes. okay. <laughs> so your feet need to be separated about 12 inches apart. Your heels are going underneath your shoulders. Now, just take a step like this. One, two. That's it. There. That's called an advance. When you're moving, you want to try to move really smoothly. So you sit down on your legs, bend your knees. Okay, don't stick out your butt. There you go. Ah, there's somewhere in between there. Okay, I don't okay. know what to do. So now, when I take a step forward, you take a step back. Now you step back. And I take a step back and you take a step forward. There you go. You're advancing, I'm retreating. And now I take a step forward and you retreat and I advance. What we try to do is hit each other from these stances. So I'll come forward and try to stab you. And as you extend your arm, you can try to stab me. So we're moving back and forth. That's right. And that's it. Yeah, it's, it's kind of it. You see these um, panels here, and they have a long court. Each of these courts are a court for two people. So when I take a step forward, you take a step backwards, and when I take a step backwards, you take a step forward. So, okay. ready? Yes. Okay, just keep on moving. Oh, is oh. it a problem if I'm already scared? Yes, no, it's fine. Don't worry, everybody loves to play with me. <laughs> I don't think. See, I was I was nervous going into this because I'm like fencing just seems like one of those sports where like everything rides on such a small margin of error that I'm just like in a panic the entire time. Um, yeah, that happens with people sometimes when they first go, but you won't have to worry about that Why? because I'm not going to be scary. You're scary right now. <laughs> sometimes you can't hit somebody by just moving back and forth, of course, because they'll just step away from your blade. So you do something called a lunge. So that means you extend your sword arm first like this, uh -huh. lift up your front toes slightly, and take a big step forward like that. And now recover. Come back up on guard. Okay. So it goes like this. Relax. So lunge. All you have to do is extend your arm straight, lift up your front toe, and take a big step. Your back hand goes down like this. That's it. Yo, know, there's one thing that I've noticed on all these skills that I've done. Horseback riding, silk spinning, and now fencing. They use the interior leg muscles. Lunging back like this is just all inner thigh muscle. Yes, it is. Also, if you notice me frowning this whole time, it's just because I had my wisdom teeth taken out like last week and my cheeks are still puffy and I can't really move my jaw. Oh, I didn't notice, no. Okay, good. It's not that I'm just like, no, this whole time. It's, it's just because that's it. Oh, this okay. is my smile. Thank you. Extend your arm. Boom, you hit me. Back hand goes down when you lunge. Recover. Head stays up. It's Head not up. a dance, so it's no. not. So your head actually, when you get your mask on, if you lift up your head like this, the blade could go and hit you in the throat. So you want to make sure that your chin is level. Not down, no. <laughs> extend your arm. Recover. And then when you extend, drop your back hand down like this. There you go. Perfect. Why the back hand? It, it helps you accelerate. Yeah, see? Ah, like, like a yeah. swimmer, like pushing through air. That's it. Yeah, just sort of like that. That works. Okay, try not to shake your head back though. Dude, you're going to die. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like you. See, you say scary things like that. Oh, I, just, sorry. I was just teasing. He's going to be fine. <laughs> You'll see him next week. Okay, so this is called an underarm protector or a plaster on. And this helps to protect the sword arm. Put this over your head like this. Oh, not like that. Oh. Duh, duh. Ah, sorry. Here we go. Put it over your head and then stick your arm in there. It's like a bib. Kind of, except that you've kind of got I a lumberjack have... shirt on. It's just a nice flannel. I know. You're going to be very warm. I'm fine. Okay. I'm a naturally sweaty man. So that's all good. <laughs> Great. Good to know. Relax for a second. You keep telling me to relax. I literally don't you know. You look a little stressed. I'm a little bit, yeah. But don't worry. It's super fun. Fencing's really fun. Uh, that's what you keep saying. Ah. Perfect. Do I look good? Handsome. Handsome? I'm medium pretty much across the board. Is Except for my head. My head is high gigantic. It is? I got like a triple XL head. Uh-oh. Okay. Do you not have a triple XL mask? Oh, I'll find one for you. Okay, so the fencing mask uh -huh. is covering your ears and your face and your throat. Right. But it's not covering at all the back of your head. What's illegal in fencing is turning around and running. Are you sure about that? I'm totally positive Why about is it that. illegal? Because it's dangerous. You don't want to get hit in the back of the head with a sword, right? I mean, my back of my head is my strongest part, so I'm pretty sure <laughs> it's capable of withstanding the most punishment. What we're going to do is we're going to put this over the back of your head like this, and oh. then I'm going to pull it down on oh. your face. Put your skin in there. Can I get your ears? Hang on, my ears are flipped. Hold I on, told dude. you, I got hold a gigantic <laughs> oh, you head. You do have a gigantic head. <laughs> okay, hold on, I have to adjust it. Pull oh. your face out. Pull it up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
Hold on, let me just adjust it a little bit for you. It's fine. Uh, I, <laughs> you keep saying it's fine. Well, You're like me whenever something goes horribly wrong. Oh, it's not that bad. That He's not bleeding said. yet. <laughs> or, I mean, at all, ever. There we go. Okay. Wow, well, oh. you do have a nice big head. Thank you. How is that? It's, uh, it's, it's not comfortable, I'll oh, tell you that. No, no, I, I can live with it. Is this no, the no, 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 I have a super tight arm. <laughs> okay. Let's try this one. Okay. This is my extra special one. Extra special. Oh, boy. Oh, that is much better. <laughs> Don't mean to torture you on your first day of fencing. Uh, you know, you say that, but the tone of your voice suggests that you, you, you are meaning to torture me. <laughs> I can't scratch my nose. Why does it seem like you're getting a lot more armor than I am? I'm not actually really going to hit you. Although I do like to tell you that, but I'm not going to hit you so much. I'm going to let you hit me, and then I'll just hit you if you do something wrong. But I'm going to do a lot wrong, because I've never done it before. Oh, jeez, that's too bad. <laughs> <laughs> so you have a way with words that makes everything you say me just not trust it. So let me give you your sword. My sword. Okay, this should fit your hand. They come in different sizes, so if it doesn't feel comfortable, That's let me That's fine. I, let I'm me not know. too particular at this point. Yes, but we might not be able to fit your hand in it. Hold on just a second. What's wrong with my hand? I think I'm going to die. I'm pretty sure she's brought me here to kill me, and the rain is going to wash away my blood. There are holes in the floor for blood to leak through. I'm pretty sure I'm going to die. Try this. Mm -hmm. Your hand goes here, all your fingers, so two fingers, one here, one there, and one here. Mm -hmm. And you have a light and the thumb wraps around like that. So you're holding it like this. Like a gun. Yes, exactly. Actually, good eye. It's called a pistol grip. Mm -hmm. So I have to tell you, it's not swashbuckling, uh, you know, wom wom. It's small, quick, precise actions with the point of the blade moving forward. Wait, I can't see because I took off my glasses, so... No, no, it's fine. I'll just be in a disadvantage. I'll aim for the blobby shape that you are and not necessarily you like... Put on your glasses. Put your glasses underneath your fencing mask. I'm good without it. No, it's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm fine. Man. The sounds he's making that are worrisome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said this was like martial arts, so it's like you gotta, you gotta. Ah! 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 The louder you are, the faster you go. So now we're gonna step back over here on the front of the floor. Go to your feet in ready position. Okay. Your heels are touching. Heels are touching. Stand straight Oops. to the sky. Down. Now you go to the on guard position. Perfect. Now, I'm just going to let you hit me. So all you want to do, don't lean into it or anything like that. Just reach out and hit me. Doink. Push. And when you push, your hand goes up slightly. Keep uh -huh. bend your knees and recover. Ready? Uh -huh. Extend and hit. I can't, I'm not really a good judge of distance just right now. Just push your hand forward. Push. Push. That's it. Push. push. Wait. Whoop. Whoop. Extend push. here and then wait for me to tap you to, for you to go back on the Okay. Arm. Extend your arm, hit. There, perfect, very good. Now you're gonna try it with a lunge, so I'm gonna step back a little further. Uh -huh. Extend your arm, now aim up here, okay. towards the blobby area. Got it. Bend your knees, <laughs> lift up your front toe, take a big step forward and hit me. Boom, and put your back hand down. Now look in the mirror how beautiful you look. I'm beautiful. Now I step forward, you step back. Don't hit me, okay? Okay. Step back, step back. Now I open up my sword like this foolishly and step forward, just extend your arm. Three, three, hit me. I'm stepping forward. So do I not step forward when I'm doing the normal? Um, no, if I step forward, just extend your arm. It's easier. Okay. So now I try to block you because you've stabbed me many times. So as you extend your arm, I try to block you, see? Uh-huh. Instead of pushing back, you just go underneath and stab me. Just to get like a, a gauge of progress so mm -hmm. that I have something internalized so people at home can get a skill base. I'm going to do this like on the age of the person that I could beat at this point. I feel like I could beat a one-year-old at this point. 
Is that safe to bet? Because they couldn't hold a sword. Exactly. Yes. So we're going to go one-year-old, two-year-old. You get up to ten? Yeah, and then if I could beat, I, I bet there are some pretty skilled ten-year-olds at fencing. There are, I yeah. really run the ringer around me, but I want to get through those, those childhood years because I feel like there's some babies I could really beat down. Okay, all right, that sounds good in a creepy way. It's called a disengage. Extend your arm. Oh, disengage. Oh, you have to use your fingers to twirl the blade. Oh, Extend do I? your arm. Now twirl underneath. Twirl. Hit. Yeah. So it's like just a wrist movement? Or? Um, no, it's a finger movement, actually. So your wrist doesn't actually move. It's the fingers controlling oh. the point of the blade. There you Wait, go. Wait, so I'm wiggling my fingers? Yeah, so if I press this way, you just see how fast that is? Oh. If I press that way, huh. see? That's what if it. you lose your grip on it? I'll stab you. Retreat. Extend. I block. Oh! Ah, sorry. I you had to go around it before you step right, forward right. to die, right? Gotcha. Toast, right? <laughs> to die. Extend. Disengage. Lunge. Boom. Backhand. Beautiful. That looks really good. Relax your shoulders because I know my they're getting tired. My fingers hurt. And then my shoulders are fine. My fingers. Just trying to squeeze this thing. I know. It's, it's actually my fencing master that taught me how to fence. He said it's like holding a bird in your hand. You don't want to crush the bird, but you don't want to let it fly either. Right, right. So it's kind of in between there. So it's not a really, it's not a death grip because your fingers need to move faster. Now we're going to learn a beat attack. Okay, so I'll show it to you. So this Ready? is the part where I get stabbed a lot. Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> but I won't hit you hard. Go on guard. Okay. Okay, so obviously sometimes I need to bring, move the point of the blade away from me. So I snap it and I extend and hit. Oh, you said ow before I hit <laughs> No, the wrist, I wasn't ready. I was holding my bird, my bird oh. is dead. <laughs> so it's a little snap uh -huh. and then an extension, see? Uh. Oh, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> but we'll make a little X here, huh? see? And then you're gonna snap and extend and hit me. Okay. Okay, you ready? Right. Okay, go. Very good. Thank Here you. Go. Very good. Thank you. Very good. <laughs> Beat attack. Recover. Disengage. Hit. Retreat. Very good. Thank now we're going to try what we call a counter attack. Mm -hmm. So now I'm attacking you and I foolishly drop my point and you just extend and hit me. So because the arm is out forward. Yeah, the, because I drop. Mm -hmm. You can extend and hit me before I reach you, see? So is every mistake foolish? Yes. Epe, you have to be very patient. It's a slower weapon because there are no rules. There is no judge saying, oh, you made this hit, this hit. Whoever hits first wins. What if I throw it? No, you can't throw your sword because then you, you won't no rules, have it. You said there's no rules. Yes, but if you throw it, what will you protect yourself with when you miss me? Well, what if I don't miss? <laughs> You're going down. <laughs> so, beat attack, lunge. Lunge, recover, disengage, hit, retreat. I beat attack you, you extend, retreat, disengage, lunge. Oh. Recover. If I'm not close enough, you can so take I, a little bit. I always got to be mindful of the distance. Yes, the distance is a killer. So do you want to try a little fencing? I mean, I'm going to lose, but yeah. You're, this is your starting line right here. Mm -hmm. And you want to stand in the middle of the fencing strip. Okay. And so you want to come forward, no, middle of oh. the fencing strip oh. as in the center, between these two lines. Right here, okay. So you want to be all the way up here. Oh, okay. <laughs> there, okay. What we're going to do is you go to ready position. Ready position? Extend. Extend. Salute. Salute. Go on guard. So, ready? No. Fence. Play. Uh -oh. uh, all you have to do is try to hit me. Oh, oh, it'll be fun. Oh, Come on, come on, get your arm. Get your arm. Just practice this. Hit me. Oh, ah! Oh, there you go. Alright. <laughs> okay, what a point for you. Really? Oh, boy. I know, I know three moves. How many moves are there in fencing? Uh, I don't know, 500. There's a lot of moves. Fence. Okay, don't forget your lunge. Right, the lunge. Move back, I'm coming forward. Okay, you don't want to okay. be this close to me, do you? Uh, no. Yeah, no. Don't be afraid. I'm not afraid. I'm brave, I'm brave, I'm brave, I'm brave. Go 
Good. 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 That's right. There you go. Was that your trying that to get yours. me to do the thing? I was trying to get you to do the disengage, yeah. Right. Oh man, my hand. Ready? Relax a little bit. We only have three points. On guard? I have three points. We need two more to win. Oh no. Ready? Ben. Oh, uh oh. Ow. <laughs> oh, no. I don't imagine there's much crying at the Olympic level. There is there. no crying in fencing. Oh, good shot. You got me. Four two. I can't see, so I'm hoping. Just aim for the big black parts. Almost. There you go. Good job. Are you tired? Yeah, extremely. <laughs> so, is that five? I don't know. Let's do one more for just fun. Okay, for fun. Come for your life. Oh, very good. You lift your mask off like this. You put it underneath your arm. Okay, extend your arm. And down. And you switch the mask to your sword arm. And you walk forward and shake hands. And you say good bout. Good bout. You're barely sweaty. <laughs> you want a glass of water? No, I'm fine. I don't drink water. Oh, okay. I don't believe in water. Okay. Only beer. No, I can't drink beer either. Oh. Well, there you have it. You want to try again? Yeah. I, it just, I want you to go as if you were in a real battle. Like, just destroy me. <laughs> I will do my best. Oh. I just want to experience. I'm, I'm terrified to see you saying that, but I don't. I want people to know what it's really like. I'm well, not will... actually in my fencing clothes, but we'll try. No matter what you do, if you even try, it's gonna destroy me, so. Can I get my glasses? I just wanna see death come. <laughs> oh, I can see. Now I've got the advantage. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Okay, ready? <laughs> nope. On par. Ready? Yes. Fence. There. No, that wasn't a hundred percent. You gotta go. <laughs> you can't just give it to me. I feel so bad. No, 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 no. Come on. That's... <laughs> it's really terrifying. A body change, just like you're, you just, you suddenly just like, you're like, we're into it. No, it's like, I would, don't worry, he'll be back next week. Okay, so your whole body is a target, right? Right, right. Uh, <laughs> he fell for that. Is that a trick? Yes. It felt like a threat. <laughs> you're only going backwards. Don't That's okay, I'm just forward. luring you into a false you're, sense of security. You're gonna run out of room. Oh, perfect. Ready? <coughs> Are you tired? Yeah, no. Bad. It's a false sense of security. Vent. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to only use action judo. No, no, do all the fancy stuff. Oh, I wouldn't want to. I know you don't want to, but... The people demand it! Oh. Oh, 
Oh, it's fine. Probably not the best move. Pretty well, actually. You're up to a 10-year-old. Ready? A 10-year-old? Yeah. Big offense a 10-year-old? Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Excellent. The big attack. Ready? The big, at the big attack. You. You attack me. I've got natural instincts now. <laughs> Except for that toe thing. Yeah, the toe thing. Mark, ready, fast. This okay, is what it's here. like Come on. to go even further beyond. Almost. Uh, oh, very yeah. good. Excellent. Ready? Yeah. Heads. Heads. Keep on moving. You're not tired, are you? No. Oh. <laughs> no, never. Never. Come on, get me. I'll get you. Come on. Uh, oh, I'll get you again, but there's just better. I'm guard. I'm guard. Ready? You know, maybe for your sake. I can... You're okay? Yeah, why? What are you talking about? I know your glasses are all foggy. Oh, yeah, you know, it's just, I just, you know, I didn't know it was deep breathing exercises, really. Oh, that's good. Mm. So we do this for practice. We practice like this for about two hours of bouting with a normal group. Two hours? Two hours? No. How long have we been going? Like three and a half? Four hours? I'm an overachiever, so you know. You probably picked that up. I know. Well, yeah, I did pick that up. Yeah. Well, you can always come back tonight and fence with the guys. Oh, yeah, well, they're the 10-year-old? No, they're like 14 or 15. They oh, okay, so just give me another 30 minutes. I'll be up to their level. Yeah. Time. <laughs> yeah. I'm more sweaty than I was when I did the silk spinning. I will tell you that. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. All right, well, thank you so much. I'll, I will use these skills to protect myself on the streets. And, uh... <laughs> Yeah, I appreciate it. I think it. it's better just call 911. <laughs> well, I mean, what's faster, calling 911 or yeah, yeah. As long as I don't tell them I'm about to do it. Uh, oh, yeah, that's true. If you don't say, here I come, wah, yeah, that would be good. Yeah, you did really well. Did that's I literally fun. say, here I come, No, wah. but I think, I think going, ah, from a long distance is never a good that's idea. That's a fake out. This is my mood. Ah, whoa. Oh. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. I it's, did. I did. It's a super fun school. What sport. was the name of the school here? Um, Beverly Hills Fencers Club. Guys, if you want to learn fencing, go to Beverly Hills Fencers Club. Website will be in the description. Go check it out. Out. Uh, Carla Corbett. Carla, I was going to say Carla. Carla, your favorite instructor. Carla will show you the business, <laughs> and if you're lucky, you can wear my jacket if you want my residual sweat. I think we'll be washing it. <laughs> they won't. They're going to frame it all. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we'll frame it. This is where the prodigy started the 29 year old prodigy who started fencing late in life. <laughs> I'm really going to dominate the uh, geriatrics bracket. Well, you'll have to wait until you're 40 for that. Got a lot of time to practice. Yeah, a lot of time to practice. Mm -hmm. You did pretty well today, actually. I think you should take it up. Really? Yeah, you did pretty well. You're you pretty serious? Well I'm, except for those minor stabbing things where you threw your body on my blade. But beyond that... I, I have this martyr complex. I just you? can't help it. Yeah. yeah, it's really good. But I think you did well. I think you, you know, you're know, you coordinated and you can move easily. And you didn't look that fearful. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Well, You're the welcome. mask was really blocking a lot so of my a emotions. Lot of it. And it, not yeah. being able to see me without your glasses, I suppose, it helped. helped. Yeah. yeah it I just did. imagined there was like a monster in front of me. <laughs> if you want to see more stuff that I try in the future, let me know down in the comments. Again, all the link is in the description below to check it out if you want to try fencing for yourself. Thank you so much. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.